goal and our mission and we're charged with making sure that they're well. So creating a supportive environment for Kearney is one of my number one um, goals for our school. And what that means is that we are checking to see if our students are socially and emotionally well so that they can attend to the things that school was created for. It was created to educate our children. It was created for um, just foundational learning and for them to be trained for whatever they have been created to do. So I think about our students and I think about what we can do to make this truly be a safe haven, what we can do to make sure that they achieve and they know what they're supposed to know to be literate, be proficient and beyond. And we want that same thing for our adults as well because uh, teachers and staff who are not well cannot ensure the wellness of our children. So it is our goal to make sure that our, our environments provide the safety that they need. It is our goal to make sure that our school provides um, the academic um, supports that students need so that we can answer and affirm when somebody else asks us, are our children well? So that is our one of our number one goals here at Kearney to make sure that we're having an uh, environment that supports them, the whole the development of the whole child. I've been with uh, Mrs. Fagans for the past six going on seven years. Um, just when I got here, uh, it was a little, you know, um, haywire. Like she came the year before I came and she needed some assistance. You know, she did pretty much everything that um, a principal, a dean, an assistant principal, a climate manager, she was wearing more than one cape, you know, um, when I got here. And just to watch her evolve into the dynamic leader that I knew she was, I mean, it's overwhelming to see it. Um, coming in every day, coming in this building and just watching it change from the students changing to the staff changing to the actual atmosphere changing around the school. Uh, the school looks so much better. Uh, the kids are so much better. Um, the learning environment is it's amazingly different. <laughs> uh, we, we have a very cute, calm school now. Um, it's very positive. I feel like uh, the staff and the kids are all much more happy. Um, they, they definitely seem more united. Um, recently, in the last several years, I would say, um, with a lot of different things that Mrs. Vegas has put in place. Even on the outside of the school, with the neighborhood being more in tune with the school than they was, you know, uh, when I got here, a lot of the neighborhood, they, you know, they had a lot of thumbs down towards Kearney Elementary. You know, some of them are still, you know, they stayed there, but a lot more, they got thumbs up because of the leader that we have in this school. And having a strong leader that actually um, gets her hands dirty as well. It means a lot to this, it means a lot to the community. I'll say that, not just the school, I want to say the community because I like to differentiate bosses and leaders. You know what I mean? A boss sits back, you know, and calls out shots, right? That's cool. If that's what you find and all dandy with, that's fine. But a leader is more detrimental to the team than a boss, right? Mrs. Staggins is an amazing leader. She uh, leads with her heart, she uh, wants the best for the children in our school, she wants the best for our, our staff, um, she's very genuine, she has all of our backs, uh, we, we know that she puts up a fight for our school and that she will always do what's best for Kearney, so we in turn feel like we definitely want to give back as much as we can to our school as well. Because a leader will get out there and show you exactly what how to do it, when to do it, where to do it, right? And that's the, exactly what Ms. Fagans does and what she has did for the past six to seven years that I've had work with her. It's, it's, it's amazing, man. She, she um, the way that she goes to battle for her staff, the way she goes to battle for these children around here. I mean, man, it's, it's very overwhelming to be in the presence of a strong leader as Mrs. Fagans. Try to Corner, 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 corner